Kate Milafolcher to Tony Creates and uh, we're, we're going to be decorating some labels, making our own labels. But before we get to that, I want to show you my, my little find I got today at the charity shop. So all of these books cost me three euros. Okay, so this is a little photo album. But I thought it would be great to put today's project in and all those little bits and pieces like this on my desk. I have this flower that's floating around. I could put it in here until I'm ready to use it. So it can go with my scrap paper book on my desk. But to the, uh, my next video is we're going to deal with the bits and pieces on my desk and then we can we might put some of them away in here. But this is going to be, this book is going to be for if I'm busy with, if I finish a project and you know there's a couple of pieces of ephemera left over and you don't know what to do with them. They're going to come in here. Okay, now this is called The Mid M Midwife by Jennifer Worth. Um, I've watched the TV series first, I think the first and second season. Loved up, loved it. Uh, so this is the book, the original book. So this is why I got it for this map. And I got it because it has these old photographs in there that I just love so this one's not so nice it's prostitutes and their customers walking away and here's the kids playing in the street so look at the poverty there anyway so i got that but this is the huge treasure oh, dun, 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 dun. this is australian wilderness uh continued on the black doesn't say who the photographer is but guys look at the size of the pages number one number two it's sewn in and then look at these graphics oh my soul just love it look at that look at that look at that so I'm going to make some wonderful journals pockets whatever from this look at that and because it's sewn in it, i can take a double spread so i can make a triple xl journal not just an xl journal the same look at that i just love it a nice thickish paper it's shiny but not glossy if that makes sense clear as mud so I am just delighted look at that delighted so I will be making some of uh, uh, Camellia Croft Julie's pockets and stuff <gasps> look at that and you see it's sewn in so what does that mean that means I can go like this go like that and pull out look at that oh my soul oh look at that pull out a whole spread like that Oh my goodness, look at those colors. <gasps> I'm going to have to make a pocket with that. Yes, sorry. An envelope. You could just cut this out like that. Make an envelope. Okay, I'm going to look for projects to do with these ginormous papers. I just, what a treasure. I paid a euro for it, people. A euro. Well, let's say I paid two euros for it not even so I am absolutely because I went online because you know she's got that um, the floor of, of uh, Great Britain or something the floral book it's like 30 euros 25 euros 23 I think 22 was about the cheapest I could find and I'm like oh look at that so 
I didn't buy it because it was way too much but I got this one instead so I am delighted so we will definitely be making some of those right what are we doing today folks this is what we're doing we're coloring our labels so here's an example so this I'm going to show you and these are just white sticky labels uh, I was in the shop yesterday and I saw one euro fifty for I mean a gazillion sheets okay so this is how we're gonna do it we can just go like this one two three one two three doesn't matter we're gonna just start painting them so <clears throat> I'm just gonna use this color that I used on this one because I like it maybe use a bit of a red and a red one let's wet that let's wet the pink let's wet the I need the names of these things mauve this is mauve okay and I'm going to use so this is all I did folks you just take your brush make your brush quite wetish get your color and you just go like that just nothing special just like it and then I've got sepia took the sepia and came with the sepia okay remember this is uh, uh, word get the word watercolor paint so it does dry lighter so that's all I did there we go put that to one side let him dry take the next one okay let's use what's this this is raw umber let's take the raw umber get that in there and don't try and dry this with your heat gun guys do you know what's going to happen it's going to lift the glue so there and then let's get some mauve okay this is quite dark i think i've got uh, quite a bit on my brush here there we go mauve okay let's get a little bit of this sepia on it's a bit darker Just, just okay gotta go open the door right back okay let's, let's do another one uh, so get more on this. whoopsie this has got just go just swish across swish across make these ones a bit darker okay and then get our turquoise and just come there we go okay next one okay uh, burnt umber get some more pigment on there and squish it and then pink so this with a with a burnt umber goes mauvey okay whoops it's nothing there with my okay now and to let's go see what happens if we put the blue down first and then come with the sepia afterwards and just go where all the white bits are come here get these a bit darker there we go 
Okay, there we go. And then this one, um, let's go totally off the map and let's do yellow. Get some yellow and go yellow. You never know when you're going to need a bit of yellow, hey? Okay, and then what we're going to do with the yellow? We've got Viridian or what's this one? Sap green. Is it sap green? Yes. We'll go sap green. going to go sap green and purple. There we go. And that's nice and light and airy. There we go. Maybe we go a third color. Should we should we put a put a, a teeny tiny teeny tiny little bit of the burnt umber teeny tiny just to make it look like it's it's antique oh look here my fingers are holding it okay so I think that's fine. Oh, our yellow's kind of disappeared. Right, folks, so that's sorted there like that. Now, now we need to just give them a sec to dry. I'm just going to give them a sec to dry, and I will be back with you. I'm just going to pack away and just get my... And, oh, by the way, you could do this with your ring enforcers as well to color them. Can't find mine. So, Yeah. We're just doing the squeeze and then what I'm gonna do I'm gonna take it and I'm actually gonna stick it in the back of the book because it's quite a quite a lot I'm just gonna take these and just keep them in here just like that because it's kind of a every now and then you pull one out right so let me um, just leave these dry Okie dokie folks, let me just bring you guys in a bit so you can see what I'm doing and uh, I'm going to be using uh, ground espresso and maybe a bit of vintage photo, don't know yet. Okay, let's just stack them all up. There we go. First one. So, ground espresso I think on this one. Um, oh, let's try vintage photo first. Don't get these mixed up, woman. Okay, and just stamp. Okay, I think we're going to go ground espresso. And stamp. And stamp. Um, let me just... Uh, get a mat to put under here otherwise you can see what's going to happen I'm going to get ink all over my mat okay let's go don't do that don't come off I think I turned this around let's just go like this good okay that's done Next, I'm going to add my, what's his name? I'm just going to take my Tim Holtz out. Wait, mind this out the way. And I think I'm going to use this one. It's nice and small. And I'm just going to go like this. And go like that. I suppose I could get another stampy stampy here. Huh? At least I can go straight. at okay this number is actually a bit big okay. sorry just get my glue book and stamp off my numbers can you see where we are in okay put him back I want a small okay he has a small one small letters let's go like that and just go like that, like that, like that. Okay, leave that one out. Um, 
then I want the round one so which way is up this way is up and just go like over four go over four go over right and then what we're gonna do next should we oh let's get some script let's get some script I think we can have there see this is where you decide you're going to um, move everything did I not words or did I decide to put I need to move words to the front that's what I need to do I need to move words to the front okay so we're just gonna go like that and we're gonna go like that good good in fact you can actually just go like this just stick it over the whole thing folks there we go look here's a blank one let's let's give him some nice dark dark handwriting okay there we go okay let me go like this I need to find a place for this I don't know I was meant to put that in a journal and I didn't let me just go like that There we go. Okay. So there's number one done. Number two. Okay. Start at the same. Again. Ta da. Just stamp away. Okay. Uh, numbers. any other these ones are different as well okay let's get the just gonna go over the whole thing and go like that Oh, that's so cool do we do the round one let's do the round one just kind of look where these roaring ones There we go. That should be good. Kind of like a. Okay. There we go. Next one. See how quick and easy this is? Okay, let's do this one. And then the other three are more or less the same. So let's go this one. And so start off with the splots. Or you can you can do them in any order. It doesn't really matter. Okay, that's enough splots. Okay, uh, let's do script. I don't think it really matters. 
matters what direction we go okay there we go circle Okay, and then we need some numbers. I think I'll put this one away. Prefer this one. Just have a look here and see. Here's a teeny tiny scripty one. Okay, there we go. Right, let's make something. I'm going to just leave that out and then I'll finish the other three so we just put those away like it like that and what I didn't plan to make something but I feel like making something okay let's move our file out the way and let's get let's get a book page here I know I've got a narrow one that could just be a journal card here we go or a tag here we go just like that okay let's uh ta -da. <laughs> okay so um Look at this piece here. How's that? Text in one direction and then text in the other direction. Let's use our ground espresso and grunge this up a bit more. It's even grungy on the other side. But, uh, oh, it's two. Let's go like that. Stuck together. Oh, I like that side. Okay. Awesome. Doing a book page tag. Okay. So you can go there. because it's around it's hanging around wait I nearly you see that did you see that did you see what I nearly did silly belly anyway folks what can I tell you so I chuffed I love my village so I went down to the post office to buy some chocolate okay and do some other banking stuff so I meet one lady have a chat meet another lady say sorry I gotta go gotta get to the post office before it closes walk into the post office hello Tony how are you I just love it I love it I love it it's just so nice it's so nice being known actually let's round let's round those corners Let's round the bottom corner like that. Now let's go seven like that and like that. Okay, we'll get you off here. Okay, like that and like that. 
and then we can just trim the top off before we get around to inking it okay so you're off I see another piece no surely they can't be oh this was just okay so that's done nice I like that now I can ink these ink those okay we need to put some backing on the back of that we need we need a well you can go back in there and keep my desk nice and tidy we need a bit of a I, I uh, was tiling up stuff on my computer and I found this piece of paper that was just sitting there oh you know what oh I kind of like this I kind of like this Okay, so he's gonna fit on there. Let's have, oh, we make him fit. We make him fit. So we're gonna take this leaf over here. Okay, so this goes from medium, medium pattern to small. And here's our here's our tree from Marguerite Miller challenge. Hey, okay, are we gonna stick him on the others? We could stick him on here as well. Hey, can we not? If we're gonna have half a flower, if we have half a flower. Let's get that off. Oh, wrong way. Half a flower. I'm just sticking this. This. Okay, can you move up a bit? You're in my way. Thank you. Um, or we could maybe fussy cut this flower put her right on the edge should we do that quickly 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 oh Anna <sighs> let's haste more speed let's go like that This is a quick one. This is a, a, a no missing. We're gonna kind of like this. And this is what we're gonna do, folks. We are only fussy cutting the one side because this side's chopped off so we're gonna stick him there we're gonna go like that now where's our tree does our tree fit on here is our tree now tree covers our nice paper so you're not going on there you're going on there i think so i think so right i got this i got this uh glue at aldi or was it little don't know got it it's green guys but it does not dry clear got it in the school pack i got a clear one i got a green one and i think there's an orange one as well so just so you know it does not dry clear so i'm just gonna get that on there I'm going to stick him there. I want to have my my edge get that glue off there. My edge showing. My nice ruffle edge. There we go. Okie dokie. Now we need to. Okay, sorry, tree, you're going back in. And I'm even going to. You see now. Now we have a problem. No, I'm throwing it away. gonna stick the leaf around there okay and then um, we need to get one of our labels wait I think I need fingers first and are we gonna decide 
I think there's yellow there so we put a yellow label down here and I'm just gonna take a random one doesn't make any difference let's take this one with the numbers <coughs> okay not so random then and there we can we can stick our stick our leaf on like that and I think I need a I think I'm gonna take another one why not who says we only have to put one on I'm gonna put another one there there and I think this needs a butterfly there. let's get our butterflies out and look at this little one is not in the right spot and then here's another one Oh, I like that. These yellow ones gonna show up over the Okay. That's it. Okay, put you away. There we go. Simple as that. Ooh, ooh, okay, not so simple. What do you think you're doing? Trying to rush. Why am I rushing? Did I check the battery on my phone? No, I don't think I did. Sorry, missed him. I just want to come and take all these white little bits off. And you, oh, you've got no feelers. We're going to have to give you feelers. Okay, well, I'm sorry. Your matey's got no feelers, so we're going to have to just... Uh, we're gonna just make you the same there we go got all the get the glue at least now I can see where my glue is so I don't go and stick something on top okay so you were going on the top like that okay and you Bit thicker and you going down here okay oh I like that I like it okay we're gonna mind you out the way we're gonna get our, our fine 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 this one and we're just gonna go like that and like that, make sure we come to the very, very end or very beginning. So there's one there, and there's one there. Okay. Right now we need to get some backing paper. That's called where's my paper? Paper. No, that's not it. Close the drawer, and then oh wait, what's this doing out? Okay, let's move him. So we need to get a piece that's going to fit. Hey, should we just stick them down? I mean, I could get a piece that fits all the way. Mm, they are bigger pieces but I kind of like having the yes I'm gonna leave that okay so I'm just gonna go I'm gonna go like this so that kind of reflects the bottom and then we're gonna go like this and take it off there okay should we ink around here yeah why not don't be lazy just just a wee bit of definition not too much okay this is a piece of coffee dyed paper guys all right
right side wrong side get our green glue out again the edges down properly oh look there a lovely green stripe down the middle right so of course my phone went and switched off so I uh, had to so I just quickly sewed so there's our tag finish actually we could put a we could put a braid on the top there um, but I'm just gonna leave it like that so folks I hope you go and make yourself some labels quick and easy nice and then I'm just going to take my book and I'm just gonna stick them in here so they're all together and then I can just quickly use them. Anyway, folks, have a great day and I'll see you soon. Cheerio now. <laughs>